Times Over Time, the Pop Slime Professor. Welcome to my channel where we talk about song lyrics. And today, we're gonna look at what you guys thought my five favorite bands were. This is gonna tell me a lot about how people perceive me, and I am so ready for it. Is he a 21 Pilots fanboy? Does he actually like AJR? How come he never makes videos about The weekend anymore? Who really is Clifford, and what is his musical taste? Fair warning, if you don't like my musical taste, we actually keep it pretty varied and broad on this channel. So if you don't like my musical taste, th don't worry, we talk about plenty of different kinds of, of cruddy songs. Sorry, I forgot to erase this from the last video. And now that you've finished weeping uncontrollably, let's get started. I think Liam guesses what I'm, I kind of feel like probably everybody perceives my musical taste as. My taste in music isn't your face, it's 21 Pilots face. T.O.P. 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 Yeah, you got it totally. Nope, actually, you're you're not far off, dang it. Shagster says, Lil Pump, Lil Uzi, Lil Wayne, Lil Dicky, Lil, I can't think of any more Lils. You obviously weren't trying enough because there's Lil John, Lil Yachty, Lil Kim, Lil Bow Wow, Lil Peep, Lil Boozy. Yeah, those are actually my five favorite artists. Psych! For sure, 21 Pilots, and I bet you used to like Panic a lot, but not recently. I somehow hope Taylor is at least in the fifth spot. Yeah, you you got eerily accurate on the Panic at the Disco side of things there. We'll, we'll see where... Where Taylor Swift ends up though. 21 Pilots, Lord, Taylor Swift, uh, probably something classic like the Beatles or Queen and I the Victor, probably totally wrong. Actually, dang, no, you're, you're, you're eerily close. 21 Pilots, AJR, John Bellion, NF, Taylor Swift. I gotta admit, those are some pretty good ones. 21 Pilots, Panic at the Disco, Taylor Swift, I the Victor, John Bellion. I worry sometimes that some of you guys may be projecting your favorite bands onto me, and I'm gonna blow your socks off, because there's already one band that, I, that is in my top five that nobody mentioned. Ah, Eileen, you're, you're, you're smart. 21 Pilots, Taylor Swift, Sufjan Stevens, John Bellion, and NF. <laughs> Snoop Dogg. Taylor Swift, Ed Sheeran, 21 Pilots, Panic, and The Beatles. Ooh, I gotta be honest, Ed Sheeran is is not up there at all. He's a good guy and he's good at what he does, but he is... Ooh, nah, man, not for me. 21 Pilots, Taylor Swift, Watsky, I the Victor, and Panic at the Disco. Watsky is definitely one of my favorite artists, that's for sure. Top five? I don't know. Taylor, 21 Pilots, Childish Gambino. Man, I feel like Arabic writing. You, you probably know me better than a lot of people because, yeah, dude, I, Childish Gambino is incredible. You don't even know. Donde esta la biblioteca me llamo ti bon la araño discoteca. Only the white fans of Donald Glover will get that. The Weeknd. He kind of used to be, actually. 21 Pilots, Taylor Swift, NF, I the Victor, and Cave Town. Cave Town? I, I've done a few videos about Cave Town, but I've never, like, put him as one of my favorites. I'm just a big fan of what he does. Okay, the, the Kill 93 got me. The jig is up. I, I can't I can't keep my secrets anymore. They're all out there. Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, Lil Pump, Bad Behaby, and Migos. <laughs> I've got a playlist of just these five artists, and I listen to it every night that before I go to sleep, and then every morning that I wake up. I'm starting a Nicki Minaj cover band. If you want to get. <laughs> I gotta get that out of my mind, man. <laughs> All right, and then finally we got NF, Eminem, Logic, Linkin Park, and 21 Pilots. That's a lot of a lot of sadness and a lot of anger and, <laughs> and just five bands. You guys must think I'm depressed. So overall, based on what you guys said, these seem to be the main bands that you think that I'm a big fan of. 21 Pilots, NF, John Bellion, Taylor Swift, Cave Town, Panic at the Disco, and AJR, based on these comments and a lot others. Well. Here's the truth, and, and first off, we'll have the runner-ups kind of in, in order, and... <laughs> Sorry to break your heart. Okay, actually, I'm not. It's the truth, and you need to deal with it and grow up. But also, I'm I'm still sorry. <laughs> Eminem, because he's got some sick rhymes. Chance the Rapper, because my gosh, that guy's incredible. Casey Musgraves, because that last album, that was good, man. That was really good. Uh, Macklemore, because he, he just says it like it is. He's sincere. Eleven D7, a smaller band I've talked about. You gotta go listen to their song, Holding Out. Watsky, I mean, who doesn't like Watsky? Taylor Swift is an honorable mention just 
because like I respect her so much, but I don't feel like, you know, I connect emotionally necessarily. Sufjan Stevens, if you haven't listened, Christmas in the Room is one of the early songs that April and I fell in love to. That was, that was a great song. And then finally, Childish Gambino, who is absolute legend guys some of his older diss rap type fun stuff and then just the new experimental i mean it just redbone blows my mind musically and the guy's got so much artistic integrity and that brings us to the top five i've just listed a bunch and so you're probably wondering like what bands are there even left only five only five bands that matter and they go in order like this number five is Lord. So much integrity, disses the pop music scene while still being more than just a disser, says beautiful stuff, is honest and sincere, makes her own musical pathways. Wow. Number four is John Bellion. No, nobody, I don't think anybody has artistic integrity like John Bellion. He just makes stuff that he wants to make. He's not in it for the cash. He talks about his own sincere struggles. And man, I connect with that stuff. Plus, anytime he starts rapping, I just died and gone to heaven. Number three, is I the victor? She's doing an incredible job, and that band is freaking going somewhere. Go listen to I the Victor. I've got a link in the description. Go listen to your stuff. I originally billed her as, as female 21 pilots, but she is her own thing and is doing great. That leaves only two, and... <laughs> Sorry, neither of them is NF. NF might have made it, he was like, he was one step away from the honorable mentions, I swear. Kill me, I deserve it, I'm sorry, I have offended. But my number two is Mumford & Sons, because Mumford & Sons is so incredible. They're one of the, the bands that first got me into just wanting to listen to music. I've never felt emotion while singing along to a song like I've felt while singing along to Sigh No More or Babble. Just, oh my gosh, those albums are so good and they were so formative for, for what made me appreciate music. Just incredible. And finally, at number one, the one that you all expected, the, yeah, there we go, uh, is, is 21 Pilots, guys. They're everything that I want in a band. The music is catchy, the lyrics are deep and meaningful. Praise, can I get an amen? But let me turn the question back on you guys. What are your top five favorite bands? I would really honestly like to know. And then check out my Dancing to the Deepest Songs of 2017 video. Yep, that's kind of trippy. And then here are the top 10 best songs of 2018. Still worth listening to. But you guys are already so smart, you're probably already listening to them. So with that, I bid you adieu. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys next time.